guys, I didn't vlog anything last night. I uh, ended up falling asleep. What do you want from my life? And uh, I ended up reading up to page like 95 last night before the readathon started and I ended up going to bed at a pretty decent hour because I was exhausted and I wasn't feeling the greatest yesterday. So I was like, let me go to bed early today. And uh, sorry, my dog is like being really annoying right now. But uh, yeah, so I got a lot of reading done last night before it started and then I'm gonna do a lot of reading today. I wanna get a lot of laundry done while I read and be more like, I don't wanna just not do anything productive today. I don't know where this ball went. So. And uh, so I'm hoping to get a lot of that done today too as I read. But uh, I started autobiography the other day and I'm really enjoying it. And I can't wait to like talk about it more. I should be getting my book of, our book, is book of the month today. So I'll open that for you guys. And uh, yeah, so I guess we'll just see how today goes. And yay for Jasmine's 24 hour readathon. Yay. So I decided to make some tea. I don't drink coffee anymore. I used to make coffee at home. My hair, we're, we're not gonna talk about what my hair's doing right now. But uh, I got a good debt and I wanna show you actually my, pro my pro progress. I started it, what, two days ago? And uh, I wanted it to finish it like during the readathon. And then I want to start red, white, and royal blue. Don't think I'm going to get to finish that, but I will definitely try to finish this if my dog lets me today. My dog is very needy and an attention seeker, so I'm pretty sure she's not going to let me do anything today. But then again, we'll, we'll, we'll see about that. But yeah, I'm making some tea. I'm going to read a little bit, then do some laundry, and then read more while the laundry's in. We'll see how today goes. I'm excited. I'm gonna have you guys watch me make my breakfast because I'm bored and I have everything ready and I wanted to show you what I eat in the morning. Normally I don't really eat breakfast, but because I'm up so early, I have some gluten-free waffles, which they're not terrible, they're actually really good. And I'm gonna make my tea. My tea. Okay. That's done. Bob's Burgers in the background, so don't mind that. Um. Let's see. Oh, this is convenient. I can use my Bob Burgers mug. I forgot I had one. So this tea that I'm using is the Sweet Cinnamon Spice Tea. I don't know, I found it in my cabinet. It's caffeine free. So, and I liked it the last time I had it. So I'm, I'm quite happy about that. I'm very really weird with teas. So like the only teas I like are like the cinnamony or like the chives. Like I don't like fruity flavored it, I'm weird All right. let's, let's do this. look at that steam the problem with when I make tea is that it's super hot when I make it and I don't drink it right away because I don't like hot drinks that's why I don't drink coffee hot the only time I drink coffee hot is when like the peppermint mochas come out and like you know you gotta, you gotta get those hot. Those are so good. I'm so, like, that's the one thing I look forward to in, like, the winter is the holiday drinks from Starbucks. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna let that in, and I'm gonna put some milk and sugar into it. Because I drank it with just sugar the last time, and it wasn't bad. I like a little milk in mine. We're gonna get the milk. We're gonna get the milk. Ooh. I can't wait to have this all across the milk. I got the milk. I wish I got the butter and the syrup out when I was in there. Okay, put some milk in there. clip of me just rambling and making food and not reading because that's what we're supposed to be doing right now 
But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna put some butter on my waffles. I don't want this kind of knife. So I'm gonna take this. It's hard to butter things that are gluten free because they tend to like, they tend to break. So I kind of just like leave it on top and it melts. I just feel like these could have been in a little bit longer too. I don't even know what's going on on the TV, but it's on. Butter, butter, butter. So what are you guys reading? I want to know what you guys are reading. So what if you guys joined in on the 24 hour read song, comment below what you guys read or are reading. Because I know a lot of you in the group chat didn't start reading it, like me, because we slept. I'm like Jasmine and whatnot. So... I was planning on staying up, but I just got hit with a wave of tiredness, and I know when I'm tired, I don't enjoy reading, and I don't observe what I'm reading, so, like, I don't even, like, bother. So I crashed at, like, 12.30, I think, and then, but I did read a lot during the day, so, like, I made up for falling asleep, which is why I did that. I don't know why I'm doing this, but, uh, yeah, so let me know what you guys are reading, and <laughs> Damn it. God. And there we go. My breakfast is made. So, yeah. That's how, that's what I, my breakfast is made. I got my waffles. I got my tea, and I'm, uh, I'm, uh, I'm going to start reading and watching some Bob's Burgers. So uh, I'll catch you guys up when I, when I update you on my reading process. See you guys next time. Hey guys, what's going on? So it's been a while since I updated you. I ended up going to see Rocket Man with my friend Jack, and it was a lot of fun, and the movie was really good. I recommend go seeing it if you haven't seen it already. It's about Elton John's life, and I find I find these movies that they do about, like, like how they did uh, Bohemian Rhapsody, I find these movies so interesting because I love learning about the artists that they do it on. Elton John is one of my favorite singers, so, like, I'm, like, finally, like, oh, yay, like, there's a movie about him, and the person that plays him, I forget his name off the top of my head, but he did a phenomenal job, like, portraying him. So that was my majority of my day, and I think I got some reading done. I'm on page 120. So I mean, and then and not too shabby for as of right now, but I'm definitely gonna try and bang this out tonight. I want to try and read it. If YouTube doesn't distract me, YouTube will probably distract me. So don't hold me to it. I'm waiting on a package, so I want to open that for you guys, which is the book of the month for bookends for July, and I'm excited to get it, and it should come today. And I'm still waiting for it, which is odd. It normally comes around, um, normally comes, like, midday, like, one-ish, and it didn't. So my dad checked the tracker, and it said it should be here by 9 o'clock. So we'll see if it's here today or tomorrow. So I'm going to get to some reading. And you can tell everybody. This vlog is really going to suck because I feel like I haven't done what I could do th at, during arena thon so I sort of failed in that, but <laughs> I made it. I still got time to go, so hopefully I can finish it within the next couple of hours. I'm on page 182, and I love how an annotated book looks. It just looks so like pretty. I just love it. My sister thinks I'm insane for annotating my books. I only do it on certain books. I don't do it on like all of them because it just it's too time consuming. That's probably why it's like taking me a little to like read it. But I'm enjoying it. I'm gonna do an actual review on this one after I post this vlog. Uh probably next week after the weekend. But uh yeah, so I'm gonna read for a little bit more and then i'll update you give you guys the last update of the of the night good morning guys um i didn't get to update you guys last night on my reading process i'm on page 210 now and i'm gonna try and finish it before i go to work today i don't have it till six so i have some time 
but uh i'm gonna make some breakfast relax and uh do some reading so excuse my voice i made some tea and i made some breakfast that that's what you hear i'm toasting some toast and then i'm gonna eat my eggs i read some i read about a chapter and a half so i'm gonna take a break and eat and watch some youtube videos and then go back to reading we decided to extend it the next day so i think i'm going to title it the not so 24 hour readathon because i think that's like really clever and i'm just like yay so uh, yeah i'm actually really proud of my like self for how much i've actually like read with the amount of time like i started on like i don't know why i keep cutting my head off i started on page like 120 i think the other day but uh i'm enjoying it so far there are some things that i'm like annoyed about in it but you can't have everything i'm leaning more towards a 4.4 4 out of 5 star rating than a 5 out of 5 because of the things that annoy me but uh yeah so that once i'm finished with that i'm gonna start red white and royal blue on audio so that way i can at least finish three books this month if i start a fourth one it might be romanov or um i wish you the best i'm not sure which one i want to read yet but uh, yeah, so that's my little update for you guys. I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna watch some YouTube, and then I'm gonna go right back to reading. Yay. So I got some book mail. I opened my book sleeve earlier, but I'm a little disappointed. It's a standard size, and it's not like the size I, I should have gotten an extra large. But I do love the, like, the style. It does fit what I'm reading currently. It fits like the basic paperback, but it's a little snug, but like it works. It does work so i know the bigger books that i have it won't fit but i have a different one for them so we're still okay but i got some book mail and i want to open it for you guys because i thought it was going to come yesterday but it came today and i'm trying to open it the best way oh wow they actually didn't give me a huge box for it oh my god this is such a big book I got the book of the month for bookends for next month is the rest of the story by Sarah Denson. I'm very excited. It's a little damaged and sticky, but it's all right. But I'm excited to read this for bookends for next month. And uh, it looks pretty, it looks, uh, it doesn't look too shabby. So like, I'm excited. I haven't read any of her books yet. So it'll be cool to like, see what her, uh, her style is as an author. Cause I know she writes a lot of contemporary books. And I'm quite excited to annotate and, like, dive into it. I may not be part of the live stream for July because of my surgery coming up. But I'm definitely still reading it. And I'm very, very excited. Yay! <laughs> so I wanted to show you guys what I do with my dog when he gets a little, like, crazy. I be give her some Cheerios and I just throw them at her. So I'm going to show you that. You ready, Pally? Are you ready, Pally? Okay. <laughs> sit 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 Pally sit good girl <laughs> why girl so i think i'm gonna end the vlog here because i have work later tonight and i know i'm not gonna vlog or do read much after work but i did get a good uh a good chunk done i started on page like 90 when the readathon started and i'm finishing on 280 i'm very proud of my reading i know i didn't finish a book like i was going to and then plan to but um I ended up going to the movies yesterday, so it kind of took away from, like, the reading time. But, yeah, so I was really happy I participated in this readathon. I extended it a little the day after because I didn't get enough reading done yesterday. So I love doing these vlogs, and if you guys want to see them more, let me know because they are so much fun to do. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.